Road, Camano Island, Washington. This uh, three bedroom, three bathroom home is a total of 3,860 square feet with 2,020 on the main floor and the balance on the basement level. Not all of that is actually living space. We'll see that here in a bit. You can see uh, Saratoga Passage with Woodby Island beyond. It's kind of an overcast day so you don't actually see the full view. But there is a spectacular view. Here's the home again. Kind of see the uh, surrounding neighborhood. This is looking up Chapman Road. And across the street we just have a kind of a gully area so there's no chance of anybody building across the street and looking down Chapman Road and back this up. is the lower parking level uh, there is a mother-in-law type uh, apartment downstairs that could be rented out and has been rented out in the past for nine hundred dollars a month uh, it has its own entry that will get to down here there's also view available or actually you can what I mean to see is you can see it from uh, downstairs as well nice little backyard here got some great trellises uh, RV parking with its own uh, driveway area it's a patio down here uh, this downstairs has a storage area with a garage door but not really able to drive to it kind of see the house there and look out at that gorgeous view again this is from the lower level this is the driveway that goes out to Chapman Road and then get down to the house here so you have RV parking and such and there's the house and we'll go up to the deck we're up on the deck now as you can see stairs down to the lower area home has composition roofing and uh, cement plank siding vinyl windows large trek deck kind of take in that view again Saratoga Passage it's a cloudy day so you can't really see it but the Olympic Mountains are to the west there and you can see to the south as well okay here is the front door a stunning double door and we'll step inside now you can see the home has hardwood floors this uh, cute little insert here in the front has a nice hanging uh, chandelier Look this way into the main part of the house, down the stairs to the basement, and back around now. And that's the hallway to the. This is what you see when you walk into the main area of the home. You have the uh, great room here to the right. You've got that magnificent, stunning view out beyond. There's a dining area there. Got this large island for lots of workspace with in the kitchen. It has granite countertops, of course, and uh, all upper end appliances. Lots of uh, storage in the pantry there. And we will walk to this room beyond here. It's a study or family room or what have you large could be converted into a bedroom but uh, currently is not um, this has lots of room and again takes in that magnificent view we're back in the hallway now to the uh, main bath on the main level here uh, full tub and back out on the hallway uh, 
home has an alarm and a, uh, a stereo system throughout. We're out to the garage now where we have a large, uh, very large three car garage. Obviously can store a big boat or any other uh, type vehicle you want. Back in the hallway uh, at the entrance, here's our entry closets. In the hallway here is a laundry room. And here is the large master bedroom with the windows and slider out to the deck with that view. And here is the master bath large jetted garden tub, a three-quarter size um, shower, the uh, granite countertops with uh, imported sinks, large mirror, you've got a private commode, and then this massive uh, walk-in closet that's got uh, ample storage space has a window for nice lighting and more storage on this side. And we're going back out now and let's take in that incredible view again. Okay, I'm back at the entrance going down the stairs to the lower level. Uh, down here we have a storage under the stairs and then another closet that has water treatment there and we've got a three-quarter bath down here and then when we go into the rest here the owners are in the process of converting this space it was just a big empty room and they're going to make a, another bedroom here. It will be finished um, anytime. And go this way. We have a large storage area. Um, it does have a garage door, but you're not able to drive up to it. But a good hobby area or just storage. Back down. Um, down the hall towards that bedroom under construction. We're now in the mother-in-law apartment downstairs, which can be secured off so the people uh, don't have access to the rest of the home. And here's the living area of that. And we'll pan around. You can see the hall area. And here is the kitchen. Very nice, ample kitchen area. Here we're looking out the uh, sliding glass door downstairs, so you do even have a view from the lower level. We're in the lower mother-in-law. There's the kitchen over to your right. That's the door to the rest of the house. And there's hardwood floors down here. This is a large walk-in pantry. Good size there. And then we've got a large closet down here with uh, storage and it's also the uh, furnace and hot water tank for this lower level and then we've got a full bath down here and, and this is a office or a study or storage area you know, closet so it's technically not a bedroom and here is the one bedroom on the main, or on, sorry, on the mother-in-law. It has its own uh, sliding glass door, as well as ample closet space. So, that uh, concludes our tour of uh, 757 Chapman Road on Camano Island. Uh, this home is priced to sell at $544,000. Um, you can find out more online at www.edfinlan.com, E-D-F-I-N-L-A-N.com, or by calling uh, the listing agent Ed Finlan of John L. Scott Real Estate directly 
at 